A hot tech device is helping an injured athlete from Philly train for an upcoming event. Health reporter Stephanie Stahl joins us to explain how this works. Wait till you see her and this device. You know, this is a functional electrical stimulation device that is helping a Philadelphia CrossFit athlete after she was in an accident with a Mack truck. Getting ready for the training that Lauren Taylor lives for. I love a really good challenge, but I love the fact that I'm still able to have a piece of me that's existed my entire life. She was an elite athlete in a number of sports, but a car crash in 2020 threatened her ability to move. I have traumatic brain injury, um, and then I also have herniated discs that have caused some lower limb radiculopathy, so life changed drastically. But Lauren was determined to get fit again. CrossFit became her salvation. I just enjoy coming here. I like the camaraderie. I like the community. I, I, I have so many good friends here. Right. So this is your home away from home. Yeah. Here it's about strength and endurance. That happens for Lauren with the help of this device. Essentially, it will shock the nerves that are not functioning and then help that muscle to activate. The Bioness L300 detects movement irregularities and deploys low-level corrective nerve stimulation. How important has that been to your recovery? It's been amazing. Um, not even just my recovery, but my overall quality of life. Now she's training for the next CrossFit Games. I was then second fittest in the world as an adaptive neuromuscular athlete in 2022. and gearing up to go back this, this calendar year to the CrossFit Games. At 32 and still struggling with the accident injuries, Lauren can't wait for the next challenge. It's uh, a motto I actually live by is be comfortable being uncomfortable. Now, Lauren says she is working closely with a physical therapist and trainer. She will be competing in the next CrossFit Adaptive Games in September in Texas. She's amazing. Yeah, what a great wow. story. Perseverance. Yeah.